Keith, what's your name again? Keith Johnston. And Keith, where do you live in Joplin? Uh, 3042 West 16th. And it looks like you've had a little bit of trouble this morning. Uh, just a little bit. Tell me what happened to the best of your knowledge. Uh, best of knowledge, uh, my wife said that it was really coming down hard and blowing and so she and the kids got in the closet and she said she thought a tree fell down the backyard and come to find out it was the KSN Tower. <laughs> now you, you say your wife and your kids, you have two children living in this house? Uh, yes I do. And they're fine. Yes, everybody's okay. Now, have you told me earlier that you uh, that you have in the past looked up at that tower from your porch and thought, "My gosh, what happened if that would fall?" Yes, we have over the, the ice storms, and also, in fact, last night we was just laughing about you could see the tower swaying pretty good. And is that something that you really ever legitimately worried about in the past? No. What 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 are you going to do now? I mean, uh, you lost a car that was new to you. Yep. A uh, big week ahead of you as far as recovering from this? Uh, yeah, just go on. Everybody's okay, so it's okay. Diana, what's your last name? Woodward. And Diana, where do you live? Uh, 3038 West 16th. And you live right next to the house that the tower fell very close to, but you said saying some damage yourself. Yes, yes. Everyone in your family all right? Yes, everyone is okay. Tell me what happened this morning, shortly after 7. Uh, well, we, we got up to uh, high winds, and uh, so we started watching the television, and, and uh, there were uh, severe thunderstorm warnings, and so we you know, continued to watch the news, and uh, the winds got stronger and stronger, and it uh, started lightning some. Our power started flickering uh, at about 7.30. The... Uh, uh, power went out and then all of a sudden we just heard a big just a big boom and the ground shook and uh, I thought that the trees had fallen and I looked out and my worst fear the KSN tower had fallen and I've lived here for 26 years and I would have never ever thought that it would have fallen but uh, Thank God everybody's okay. All of our cars got hit with the cables and debris. Uh, the neighbor's house took the worst of it. Uh, his front yard's pretty much demolished. The tower's laying in it across the road. And uh, very bad, very, very bad. But uh, thank God that no one was hurt. And uh, it's just time to, to clean up and, and go forward. <laughs> but uh, it's very scary, very devastating. Thank you, Diana. What's your name? I'm Bill. And Bill, where do you live? Just a couple blocks over to the to the north there. On which street? 14th. And that's pretty close to the KSN studio? Yeah, just within, I always told everybody that if the tower ever fell, it hit our house. I'm just, didn't ever think it was an option. <laughs> Is this something that you, you, you might have joked about from time to time, but? Yeah, sure, you know, I uh, never thought it would fall like this. Now, wh where were you when this all took place? Do you know what time it actually came down? I don't know exactly what time. It was sometime a little after seven. And did you hear it? Did you just hear about it? No, it was just it was it's too noisy. The, the wind coming through these towers over here makes it almost unhearable when it gets when it kicks up real high. What did you hear prior to this coming down? Just uh, t tornado sirens come on after all of this happened. So it was just it was just the wind. You just you just hear things. Everyone in your family safe? Oh yeah. yeah. 